you all for coming out tonight. We are going to perform yet another Herald. So uh, just to get us started, we need one word from the lovely audience. Spirit Lasso. fingers. Lasso? Lasso. Thank you. Lasso. 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 Wonder Woman. Metal bra. Truth. Visible <laughs> chat. Justice. Revenge. <laughs> Prison. So hating. <laughs> so there I was. I was just robbing a bank, and all of a sudden this guy comes up and says, "Put down your gun." I was like, "Well, fuck you." <laughs> you don't know me. You don't know my bank account. <laughs> so I slapped the coffee out of his hand, and I went right in. That's right. I mean, I'm there to rob a bank, so I'm gonna go ahead and take some money, and he, no man is gonna stop this. Fuck no. Uh -huh. We can kiss that ass. Right. And I'm getting it all in Susan B. Anthony dollars. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Money. Power. Greed. Control. Lasso. The Wild West. Bullets. Gunpowder. Railroads. Mm, train robberies. Ooh, engines. Listen up, everyone. This is only going to take a second. No sudden movements. Oh, but I, I, I really, I, I, I just have to pee. Okay, you can go to the bathroom, but no one else moves, all right? Uh, um, I, I have a baby. He likes to squirm. Oh, all right. <laughs> you sit in the back and don't say anything. But everyone else, I'm serious now. I have a dog that's in the storage in the car next to this one, and I really, I couldn't bear to leave him alone right now. I really like dogs, all right. I have Parkinson's disease! <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunate. <laughs> Catastrophe. Hurricane. Circular. Lasso! <laughs> Sound system. Boombox. Stereophonic. High five. Hmm. Wolfa. Wolves. Liam Neeson. <laughs> Do you guys hear that? Could have sworn that was Timberwolf. You know what that means? They're out for blood. <laughs> and when they're out for blood, those Timberwolves, they sniff it down. And we are so juicy. Juicy limbs, brains, <laughs> they will surely come after us. When they're out for blood, there's nothing that stops them. Even Liam Neeson. <laughs> <laughs> heroes. Super heroes. Oh, ultra heroes. Oh. Uber heroes. <gasps> Captions. Lassos! <laughs> Tommy, thanks for bringing me along. I, <laughs> Jeff, don't worry, you're going to be the best scout of all. You'll be Eagle Scout in no time. I really want to be, I'm working to be a lookout one day. Good, like, good. Like my dad. My dad was the best lookout there ever was. Yeah, all right, well, this is the, the campfire. Now, I want you to start this campfire without using any matches or a lighter. Like, just do what I showed you, you know, with the sticks. Listen, I don't want to. I don't, don't want to learn about fires and and wood and timber and all the other badges. I want to be a lookout. I want to be a scout. I want to be able to see things that nobody else can see. I want to be able to look over shoulders and know what's coming behind you. <laughs> you don't have to go camping to learn all that. You can just keep being Tom for crying out loud. Ooh, is there a badge for that? I'd be good at that. <laughs> yeah. Sure you would. We're gonna learn how to be a real scout. Oh, I mean the scout that's up in the tree with the binoculars looking out at all the people and say, look, there they come, let's go! <laughs> what? Yes, you can do that. You're going to do that in case we get attacked by engines. Yes! <laughs> Just haven't been around for a hundred years. That's okay. I'm sure there's still some that we can look out for. Well, see any women? <laughs> 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 Milfs? 
not sure what that means, but yeah. <laughs> Pushing my luck just a little far, then. I can spot anything you need me to spot. Yeah. Yeah. I want you to spot me a blonde 58, 38D, <laughs> 33 and a half. <laughs> hey, Kathleen. Oh, you, this is new, and I, I didn't think you normally came to the bank and you need to make your deposits. Just trying to drink. That's all I'm doing. Here in the bank. <laughs> <laughs> Thought I'd you know hang out and to see what was going on. I, all the stuff about banks these days, you know. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing here? Well, I came, I came to make a deposit. Oh. I came to make a deposit, but I don't really like to make deposits in front of people that I know. I mean, I know I've had a problem with alcohol, but you don't have to avoid me. I mean, you know, I'm a person too. What's in the cup? Um, a deposit of my own. Cranberry <laughs> <laughs> juice and other things. <laughs> okay. Um, how long do you think you're going to be here? Because I, I, I have this deposit and I, I'm kind of like on a schedule. Well, I mean, I'm, you can do whatever you want. I'm just hanging out here. I mean, I can help you. I, I know the guys over there. <laughs> hey, Jimmy. <laughs> I mean, you, you know them? They hooked me up earlier, you know. <laughs> yeah, I can help you out. I mean, are you are you in a hurry? Um, I, I was, but now that you're here... Is that a mask in your pocket? No, 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 no. It's just, it's a scarf that I fit down there. I wear a mask too when I do sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> At the nursing home, usually. It's even more awkward than a bank. <laughs> hey guys, I thought I knew who it was. What's going on? Oh my god. Tommy! Hey! Tommy, hey! How's it going? Hey! Woo! Lied! Yeah. Deposit? Uh, I was going to. Okay. I'm not so sure now. The bank will be closing in five minutes. You better hurry up, Kathleen. I may go try the uh, DuPont branch. Oh, okay, great. Later. Okay. <laughs> 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 and then I'll be gone. Richard, you want to kill our baby? No, no! I was going to do away with myself. Oh, oh, okay. Hold on, let me just hold her for a minute. You know she's very smart. She's already talking quietly. <laughs> In our mind. I didn't even understand. No, she's, she's saying, tell Richard not to go. Otherwise, He's a big fat jerk of a dad. Oh my god. Richard. <laughs> I would never abandon her after that. <laughs> I didn't think you would. Here you go. Oh, oh. Here you go. 
she loves you. I think you. she made a godly, godly poo poo. <laughs> Richard, you're getting a ticket, you're double parked. Oh my god. You might want to take care oh, of that. Oh my god. Can you take her? I can't. I, the shame. I couldn't bear carrying this child to the scene of such shame. Okay, I'll carry you and we'll go together in your car, okay? <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> You can just stay here. <laughs> I'm just afraid people will talk. She's so young, and you know what a reputation can do to a child. Even a child is immortal as that. Mm -hmm. You don't want to be seen with her in your, your car? I'm not worthy. How many times do I have to tell you? OK, Richard. Hold on one second. She's saying something. <laughs> Daddy is an asshole. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm an asshole! Richard. She, she knows. She knows better than you. From the mouths of babes. Okay, fine. Abandon us, Richard. Abandon us. Abandon your goddess child. She could have helped you with that ticket, you know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, gather round, superheroes. Uh, I feel like something's lacking. You know, wind tunnel. What was that? <laughs> <laughs> it's barely a breeze. I didn't get my my daily allotment of vitamin E, and my back and sciatica were acting up. <laughs> I just my heart wasn't in it. I'm sorry. I had nothing. <laughs> Car crash girl. <laughs> I know. You missed. I know. <laughs> <laughs> My impact is so off. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, in her behalf, the speed was really, it would have been a great If there had been a little wind to, like, help yeah. her. Could have, would have, should have. I'm hearing a lot of that. Just saying. Yeah. Just saying. Yeah. Scorpion. <laughs> <laughs> You're not stinging anyone. <laughs> Don't help old ladies across the street. I just don't, I'm not as limber as I used to be, you know? I, just, I don't have the, the kick as much as I used to. No more winter weather excuses, all right? Scorpion, just It's a valid excuse. It don't, don't be mean to them. I mean, yeah, you're, you're one to talk. What? Listen, Have I coddled you too much? Puddle boy. You haven't seen much water happening on your side. <laughs> We're in the middle of a drought. Yeah. We're having trouble with the city's water. It's not, <sighs> not, you know, it's it's lactated really blood. Is. <laughs> it's not working yet. We're a mess. We're a mess. It's the acid rain. It's the acid rain. <laughs> Hey, acid rain girl. At least I'm doing my job. Yes. <laughs> Listen, I uh, heard you want to uh, see things from far away. Yeah, like that's me. Ultimate sure. consciousness uh -huh. all the time. Oh, I got these pills. Ultimate consciousness? Yeah, yeah. I want to think about it. If you, yeah. if you want an army of guys that can see across the... An army? That has, they can see through buildings and, and perceive what's going on and, and, and lands far away. It just, you know? Yeah, you got it. <laughs> that's right. I can you see, see your soul. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> you have a choice, Eagle Scout Master. <laughs> Did you supply a whole troop with this? Of yeah. course. That's not wise. <laughs> oh, now, now you are so wise after just 12 pills? You don't know what I've seen. Listen, Frank, uh, the parents are very concerned. You know, your first year having kids go out and scout out women that you could have sex with. <laughs> You're now distributing any sort of amphetamine and hallucinogen no, I gotta to children. keep going longer. It's just not kind of the merit badge system we had in mind when we put you in the Scoutmaster. But it's real world appropriate. <laughs> it's not the 60s, Frank. You know, maybe we didn't get everything right back then. Now's our chance. <laughs> Go back and fix past mistakes. We can get these kids out. It'd have been a lot easier. Hi, Richard. Hey. Hi. 
Hi, I'm Molly. Richard. Yeah. Call me Dick. Dick? <laughs> <laughs> so um, my church thought we'd be a good match. <laughs> I worship many churches. <laughs> I like to do basket weaving and um, occasionally ride horses. What do you do? I like to imitate horses. <laughs> and I like to take the baskets and get in them and pretend I'm a little baby who needs to be fed <laughs> by mommy. <laughs> so you kids, that's what I want you looking for. I, I do what I can, you know. I've seen things now. You've seen things, you've seen You've seen into women's hearts. You it's dark in there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Scoutmaster, we found that uh, adult-sized bassinet you were looking for. Oh, excellent! <laughs> yeah. I can't get the spot out. Blood won't come out of this carpet. Do you want me to call 911? <laughs> Miranda! No, 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 Nothing happened. Nothing happened. I mean, he just, he fell down. And the gun was on the table, and it just sh shot him in the chest. And, I mean, but the blood in the carpet is really the big issue, right? He's just dead. He's not going anywhere. <laughs> yeah, I... I realize that, Susie, but I just think it might be an idea just to get a good idea just to get the police over here so they can deal with the carpet. No, no, no. That's a really bad idea. That's a really bad idea. Oh. Hey guys. Oh. <laughs> Should, does your crime scene clean up? Yeah, I thought you were gonna be here ten minutes ago. Uh I'm sorry, I was just late. <laughs> Uh, this is a crime scene down in DuPont. <laughs> no, 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 we need you here. Yeah. You sure? We need you here. All yeah. right. Okay. Cool. Hey, Sam, uh, looks like I'm going to need the big piece of chalk for this one. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. I thought you were someone else. <laughs> yeah. So, I, mean, I really think it might be a good idea to get the police involved. No, 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 no. No. Come on. These guys, no. no. Bag them and tag them, or the other way around. <laughs> Tag him, then bag him. Right, okay. We'll do that too. Okay, but I really need to get this skin out of the carpet. <laughs> all right, all right. Miranda, I brought some shout. Stay in there. Wait, 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 wait. Don't you think his family's going to come looking for him when they realize he didn't make the deposit? <laughs> 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 now there's blood getting everywhere. <laughs> You guys are changing policies all the time. <laughs> what? I would think that plastic sheeting is like normal for this situation. Yeah, but we don't have sheets that large. He has to be cut up in slices. But then <laughs> the blood. There's more blood. Maybe we should just bring in HR and discuss this. You know what I mean? <laughs> 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 So uh, your dad was dead beat too, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Mine wasn't a real good role model. It's hard moving worlds around without a good role model. It is hard. It is hard. It's lonely. And nobody to guide you, you know? How far away should they be from the sun, you know? I don't know. I mean, hey, you guys look sharp. We have uh, another Olympic couple coming in who can't have mortal immortal children, so they're looking for to adopt. So we're just you know get ready, bring out your best. Wonderful. This may be your day. I feel good for you guys. Parents, Dad. Do you think they might take both of us? I don't know. Why do we have to have such shitty dads? I've been here longer. I gotta go. Oh, you're gonna pull that card? I'm more lovable. What? Because I'm young. They can still form and shape me. You're, you're you already. They're particularly looking for someone who can make the sun rise and set. I totally got that. I was doing that way before 
you? I'm really good at the moon, though. Who doesn't want to look at the moon? Yeah, but the sun gives life. The moon... Shit. It controls the tide. <laughs> yeah, that's important. Yeah, not as important as, as, as you know, fomenting growth and, you know, plants and animals and trees and people and... Preferably gifted and talented as well. They want you on the right track. <laughs> okay. Okay, I got this. I got this. Yeah, you do. <laughs> I mean, come on. Listen, don't, listen, you can. Don't sell yourself short. You should really, really wear this jacket. It, it, it just brings out your eyes and your smile, and you look really pretty in it. Thanks. They're going to love you. That's really sweet, but you know, don't sell yourself so short. You're talented. Am I? Yeah. I mean, the moon's going to rise anyways, the tides, and you know, that stuff just happens. The sun, that's important. But you have really great interpersonal skills. <laughs> These pigeons, they remind me of my, my old grandfather, old Pappy. He passed away about a year ago today. He was kind of loopy old codger, but he always gave me a Werther's original. <laughs> he would spout off this nonsense and <clears throat> blabber about about nothing, and but it was just so genuine from his soul, loving. I know, like when he spit in my face from talking, it was like I was. I felt like I was really his, you know, like his DNA was like on my face. <laughs> he didn't know he was much like me. All when I was changing his diapers, he beat all over my face. That's wrong. <laughs> Listen, I mean, you know. They they had a lot of wisdom in those in those years, and gave us a lot of tips about life, right? Yeah, that's a good point. And uh, you know, some of my greatest experiences were because of you know the old pappy taking me to the carnival and showing me the bearded lady. Yeah, you know, he taught me about the birds and bees. You know? Yeah. He he demonstrated it live for me once. It was amazing! <laughs> if it wasn't for Pappy, I wouldn't be the confident young man that I've become. Yeah. Full of vigor and, and excitement. Pappy gave me $20 every week, and it really helped me get through life. Of course, he'd have me buy him booze and <laughs> cigarettes and... Yeah, but he introduced me to Cisco and Thunderbird. It's got to be worth something. He uh, did have me running numbers, though, down in Harlem. Yeah. <laughs> he had me pick up hookers for him. <laughs> he got me shot. <laughs> I have a balloon of cocaine still in my intestines. <laughs> you that scoutmaster that... Knocked up all those scouts and <laughs> got them high. You better believe it. What a joy. I'm not sure that's a badge of honor in this place. <laughs> You're that scout master that had been using scouts as mules for cocaine down to Mexico? That was me. <laughs> You're a bad motherfucker. Hope you know how to tie some knots, scout master. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know <what> I mean? <laughs> you got a merit badge coming to you. Hey, Scoutmaster, I heard you need somebody to give you the cover of night. I'm really good with darkness at nighttime. I bring the moon up. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be needing some moon cover. Yeah. <laughs> I got nothing else better going on. Nobody else wants me, so you can take care of me every so often. And better take his advice. The true you, Scoutmaster, knocked up a $10 whore and then rejected that baby 100%. It's true. That's low. That's low. That is low. Yeah, I could have got one for five, but I really couldn't negotiate her. You can bring that out to the ocean permanently. Got it. Oh, excuse me, guys. Hi. I'm Jen. I'm from um, the Church of Jesus Christ and Latter day Saints. And um, I'm here because I want to be your pen pal. Yes. Yes. <laughs> but I wanted you to know, Steve Young was bringing me on his great, 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 great grandson. 
Still is, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's why he threw all those touchdown passes. To You're a creepy motherfucker! <laughs> hey, I'm no Tim Tebow, at least! <laughs> Knew that back a <laughs> wow. I can weasel out of this, Scoutmaster. Pappy? <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> You were dead! We buried you! I'm confused about this visitation policy, frankly. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much.